Oh my god. I can't believe I'm doing this right now. Oh, I just I just feel really happy right now. And uh and it's this amazing feeling to be happy. I, I don't know if you've ever been happy, but it's a really great feeling. And as somebody who who identifies myself as being depressed a lot, not really being happy a lot of the time, this is really big for me. And I think that if you can figure out what the heck it is that makes you happy in your life, you're, you know, you'll know when you feel this way <laughs> what that thing is. Just keep doing that thing over and over again so you can keep being happy. I think that's really what we're all trying to do is recreate that state of just joy and bliss and happiness. And for me, it's been hard to figure out what the heck it is that makes me feel like this. Um, because a lot of things just don't. But there is one thing, and that's kind of why I'm making this video right now. And it's been extremely um, difficult for me to admit this and be honest about it with everyone because you know I'm not really sure if I want to tell people what's going on with me the truth is though that I, I can't avoid it it's too big of a thing in my life it's too big of a part of my life it is who I am and it's what makes me get like this it's what makes me happy it's and, and, and oftentimes I don't tell people what I do and it's not a great thing to be living like that. It's really not. So why, what is it that I get happy about all the time? What is it that brings me the most joy? Number one, before I get into the specific thing that you know I want to talk about, number one, I become happy when I realize that it's much, much easier for me to actually obtain um, the or obtain the level of achievements that I want to achieve. In other words, I have an image of this perfect version of myself in my head and you know it's me at my highest potential. But the problem is most of the time I'm unhappy because I don't feel like I'm reaching that potential. So I get happy when I realize that I'm actually closer to that ideal self than I actually think I am or it's easier for me to get there than I thought. I'm only a few steps away. It's this moment of just inspiration, and it gives me the motivation to just start doing stuff to get there. It just gives me the motivation to get my life organized. I'm motivated to just take the necessary steps that I need to take. Because, you know, if, if you really want to obtain that um, level where you have reached your highest potential, you're going to have to put a little bit of effort into it. And, <laughs> and when I realize that I can do it, and I want to do it, and I'm gonna do it. It's just this weird moment where, you know, I feel invincible. And that's where I reach this state where I'm literally sitting here just laughing for no reason because I realize that everything in my life makes me happy and makes me feel good. It, it is literally the state of ecstasy. And it is, I think it comes from having all my worries go away everything, all the chaos of life, all of that just disappeared for the moment in my mind. And in my mind, nothing bad is taking place. It is ultimate peace and happiness. And I want you, I want everybody to be able to experience this, that's for sure. So, now, the point of this video, the question is, what is it about me and my life that makes me feel this way? Well, moments before I took out the camera and turned it on for you to watch this, I had a moment where I shared something with somebody online. I did something, I said something to somebody, and somebody felt inspired from the things that I said. Simple. I was able to express myself in a way that, you know, isn't normal for a lot of people, but we live in this year, this time, this age where technology and social media is a really big part of our life and we have to recognize that. And I engaged in communication <laughs> online and something just clicked, something translated well between me and uh, somebody else, other people, whatever. <laughs> and you know, 
that is me reaching my highest potential is being able to talk about ideas, being able to make somebody else feel good, being able to talk about things, being able to just, uh, you know, express ideas and share ideas and, you know, motivate people, inspire people. Basically not keep my mouth shut. And that might come from a history of me being the quiet person. That might come from me always feeling like I've never been able to be that person. So maybe just in my head, my ideal self, the best self that I could possibly be is somebody who is able to communicate well and talk to others well and communicate and make somebody else feel good, whatever. So when you put all this together, you're going to find me being most comfortable. Because I do have a lot of social anxiety. I will feel most comfortable doing this, talking to a camera. So, you might see me more often posting things on social media in video format like this because I'm going to be effective this way. I'm going to actually be able to say things that I believe are important and say things that I think will be powerful and, and, and really, um, you know, communicate things very well to people. I really feel like this is a skill that I can work at. How can I get better at making a video like this where I just talk, sharing ideas, making people feel better? And how can I do it in a way that is actually meaningful and powerful and effective? And doing it makes me happy because the responses that I get from people validate what I'm doing. The responses I get from people are my motivation. I'm not, all, not only am I doing something that I want to do, I'm, have, I'm making a positive difference on other people and the world. I'm changing the world one person at a time. And um, I'm not afraid to admit that this is what I want to do and that this is what makes me happy. This is what makes me reach that state of invincibility and ecstasy and happiness, peacefulness. Um, and it's something that I can actually work at. So I'm actually able to work hard and develop skills and, 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 and develop a strategy. You know, it really employs all of the um, best um, things about myself that I like and that I'm good at and that I want to be good at. It employs them all. Strategic, you know, heartfelt, inspirational, um, redeeming myself for things that I've always wanted to be, you know, like I don't want to be that shy person, you know, I want to, I want to have people like me, I want that attention, maybe that is just, you know, I don't think that's a bad thing necessarily, um, but it's definitely a reason for doing something, and uh, the point is, videos on Facebook, videos on YouTube, videos on Periscope, videos on whatever. I want to write a book, I want to communicate ideas, I want to talk about things, I want to make people feel better, I want people to believe in themselves, I want people to think about their life strategically and try to grow into the best version of themselves. That's pretty much it and it's been something that I've been passionate about for a long time and it's about damn time that things get going and I start taking it seriously because this is the one thing that makes me feel happy and if I keep suppressing it I might just spiral down into an even worse depression than what I've already had and if this is the thing that's going to make me happy I need to keep doing it over and over again and not stop. So, get used to it. <laughs>